Applied Linguistics Group uploaded this video for BS English students. Dr. Khalid Malik, the founder, has a PhD in Applied Linguistics TESOL. Having more than 25 research papers, he taught at many foreign universities and is now in a postdoctoral study program abroad. Join Applied Linguistics Group at youtube.com slash at 1966 Pakistani or use a QR code to join our Facebook group at Computational Linguistics, Challenges and Implementation of Strategies Challenges and Strategies, 2 For language and humanity students, the main Challenge in learning computational linguistics seems to be The aversion to formal representations This can be easily Explained given that formal models and representations Usually use logic math and computer science symbols and notions such as predicates, quantifiers, boolean operators, set theory concepts and notation, lists, and so on, and language and humanities students often do not study math since middle school, so an extra effort is required to learn the necessary concepts and meta-languages. As mentioned, before, the formal character of theories and models is not the only handicap when dealing with computational linguistics. Theories The lack of theoretical diversity, i.e., the notion that there might be several alternative theories and models for a given phenomenon with different strong points and weaknesses often stands in the way of students. Four instance, students are often convinced that the Chomskyan notion and representation of syntactic phrases, noun phrase, verb phrase, prepositional phrase, etc., is universal and is equal to reality. And this is a quite serious barrier to overcome when faced with a head modifier rule in the format of attribute value matrix of HPSG, for instance. Although many basic assumptions of this framework are shared with and all come from Chomsky's generative grammar. One strategy to overcome these difficulties is making students using available and quite simple tools for implementing linguistic knowledge for instance and provide simple context free grammars builders and parsers that allow students to build and test grammars that produce the following language set of sentences dogs hunt dogs dogs hunt cats dogs fear dogs dogs fear cats <coughs> cats hunt dogs cats hunt cats cats fear dogs cats fear cats the use of these available and easily accessible tools and applications is, in fact, a quite simple strategy. But it allows students to grasp and exercise several important notions and skills, such as I, there are several adequate ways of reaching the same result, choosing one over the other requires taking into account the goals we are aiming at. 2. Traditional linguistic knowledge can be easily Translated into formal and rigid representations. 3. Computational, linguistic theories are complex. Because they have two, simple and two rigid formalisms and theories do not explain or cannot reproduce natural languages. 4. Computational linguistics and NLP tasks are often concerned with specific and modular goals, i.e., we do not have to account for everything all at once. Copyright symbol 2016 COPEC September 4th to 7th 2016, Costello Branco, Portugal. Two World Congress on Computer Science, Engineering and Technology Education. On industry requirements. All the issues discussed above are relevant when it comes to industry requirements. Given its range of applications, 
Computational linguistics is an area with high applicability and employment potential. The table below presents a summary of areas, tools, and applications of computational linguistics. Table 1 Computational linguistics applicability. Area tasks are modules, tools, and applications. Shallow. Processing. Word segmentation. Hyphenation. Lemmatization. Optical character recognition. Documentation management. Speller. Deep. Processing. Lexical analysis. Morphological analysis. Syntactic analysis. Semantic analysis. Syntactic and style checkers. Information extraction and retrieval. Summarization. Machine translation. Natural language interface. Natural language recognition. And generation. Artificial. Intelligence. Pragmatic analysis. World knowledge. Inference and reasoning. Learning. Natural language. Interpretation and. Understanding. Given its nature, industry is goal-oriented, usually. Focused on solid and tangible results for specific products. But in computational linguistics, these may also imply the theoretical knowledge to sustain adequate options. Consider, for instance, the development of a syntactic checker. This may involve, first and foremost, the analysis, description and understanding of common writing human errors. It would not be useful to detect and correct an error. That occurs only once in 200.000 pages. This first task requires only knowledge in linguistics and typically language dependent. For a second task, however, it is necessary to understand the final application or tool to be developed and the available resources, the computational. Linguists will be constrained to work with E. Will there be a complete lexicon with morphological, syntactic and semantic information or a simple word list? This second task asks for a more interdisciplinary knowledge, merging linguistic and computer science skills and strategies. And finally, a third task could consist of writing a program that Includes a parser, syntactic analysis, identifies the errors, and proposes the proper corrections. This work concerns mainly, and naturally, programming skills. Computational linguists should, in fact, respond to all these challenges, but given the two paths, balanced teams are often composed of professionals from both areas, computer, Scientists and linguists specialized in NLP or computational linguistics. As it would be expected, industry requirements for computational linguists concern goal-oriented approaches, i.e., people that easily accept that what is necessary is to solve a given problem and not all related issues. Solid basic knowledge, people with solid theoretical background and able to recognize and recommend reliable sources, e-authors, grammars, lexical resources, corpora, flexibility and adaptability more than specific skills in specific programming languages, more often than not. Professionals are required to learn and work with programming languages and environments developed specifically by the industry. Final remarks. The challenges and target audiences of computational linguistics teaching reflect the interdisciplinary nature of 
this field, but also professional requirements of the industry. So, and as final remarks for this discussion, it might be relevant to list some aspects presented so far and raise attention to them. Considering teachers with academic backgrounds different from that of the target audience, i.e. linguistics background for computer science, engineering and technology students, computer science background for language and humanities, students. This would allow for compensating and strengthening students' skills in linguistics and logic and programming background, respectively, using different approaches directed at the different target audiences, analysis of linguistic data and exploitation of implicit linguistic knowledge for computer science, engineering and technology students to show them the usefulness of theoretical linguistics and the relevance of idiosyncrasies and diversity in natural languages for NLP tasks, hands-on exercises with available tools for implementing specific theories and models for language and humanities students to show them the importance of formalization and of the use of formal metalanguages exposing students to several theories and models training their flexibility adaptability and necessary distinction between knowledge explanations and goals teaching or learning computational linguistics may be improved by simple strategies like these which acknowledge and respect the interdisciplinary nature of this field and the differences of the target audiences that are drawn to it applied linguistics group uploaded this video for bs english students dr khalid malik the founder has a phd in applied linguistics tesol having more than 25 research papers he taught at many foreign universities and is now in a postdoctoral study program abroad join applied linguistics group at youtube.com at 1966 pakistani or use a qr code to join our facebook group at